Don't keep me waiting too long now. <laughs> Considering taking this job? The terms are ridiculous! Halt, you two! Huh? What did we do? Miss Hiragi has a letter for you. She insists that you read it immediately. A letter? Quick! Let Paimon see! So this means she wants you to secretly meet her at night? But you didn't seem surprised at all by this. What's going on? Finally arrived. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Hiragi Chisato. This is technically the second time we have met. It's a pleasure to see you again. Wow, she's the daughter of the Hiragi clan, all right. Uh, no need to be so formal. I've long marveled at your accomplishments, and at last we have the chance to meet. Is it Paimon, or does something seem a bit off here? The reason why I wanted to secretly meet you here is, well, I feared that I might never have another opportunity to discuss this with you. Discuss what? Ahem. I should like to ask for your help with delivering a letter. Ugh. Like father, like daughter. Couldn't you be more original? No. You misunderstand me. Please, allow me to explain. I was hoping that you could deliver a letter to Narukami Island in my stead. It is to be given to Kujo Kamachi of the Tenryo Commission. My father has always forbidden me from communicating with him. He knows that there are prospects for my marriage that would better serve him politically. But my heart is with Kamachi. <sighs> there is no one who would dare defy my father's will on Rito, but you are outlanders. Outlanders seeking to get to Narukami Island. It would be regrettable to let such an opportunity pass. Oh, Paimon gets the whole picture now. Of course, in doing so, I will also do everything in my power to help you leave Rito. That is my promise. To be perfectly honest, as long as you remain in Inazuma, my father will have no intention of letting you leave Rito. Yeah, we figured as much. It was pretty obvious he was just trying to hold us up here. I secretly overheard a conversation between my father and a very arrogant-sounding woman just a few days ago. They seem to be discussing how to keep you here on Rito. In fact, 
It was the first time I had ever heard my father speak so respectfully to someone who wasn't the Shogun. We don't have much time. I'll tell you my plans to help you off the island. It just so happens that a shipment of goods is... Very well. I'll be waiting for you at the border. I'm counting on you to deliver my letter. Hold on, please. These goods are being sent to Watatsumi Island? My lady, this is an unexpected honor. Uh, you are correct. These goods have been repeatedly requested by the Kanjo Commissioner. We must be certain that they reach Watatsumi Island intact. Is there something wrong, Lady Hiragi? No, as you were. My father simply has some concerns of the shipment's safety, and has ordered that myself and an additional qualified escort be dispatched to ensure safe transport of the goods. My lady, you aren't suggesting that you intend to escort this shipment personally, are you? There's certainly no need for you to trouble yourself with such a matter, and as for this qualified escort... Please, do not cause us any further delay. If memory serves me right, my father has already asserted that this shipment must arrive on time. I'm certain punishment will be duly dispensed if it fails to do so. Yes, of course, my lady. It, it's just that, well, we don't know who this... Now, need I remind you of the penalty if anything were to happen to me en route? I'm sure you are all quite familiar with my father's temperament. Do you really presume that you can fully guarantee my safety on your own? Boy, Chisato can talk the talk. They don't stand a chance. Uh, uh yes, my lady. Very well, then. It, it's an honor to have you accompanying us. Your safety is our highest priority. Shinojo, you can't really be agreeing to this. Well, the request is from Lady Hiragi herself. It is our duty to serve her in the utmost capacity. Yes, but that's not the problem here. Well then, if we're through here, I suggest we set off at once. Dawdling will only allow potential thieves more time to prepare, no? Yes, my lady. You heard her. There's no time to lose. My lady, please stay back. We'll handle it. Not as well as we'll handle it! Into the wind! Time for your appraisement! Dodge this! Wind strider! Fallen leaves! Adorn my knight! Such a pain. The wind knows it. As a good monster sighted, prepare to counterattack. Protect Lady Hiraki at all costs. We'll take care of this. Stay with Chisato. One with wind and clouds. That hurts. Come. 
We can take refuge in the village up ahead. How are you faring, my lady? I'm perfectly all right. You may stop here. The road to Narukami Island is just over there. In my letter, I've requested Kamachi to grant you a special travel permit from the Tenryo Commission. Consider it a token of my appreciation. My lady? Huh. So that's how it is. I, I had a feeling something was amiss, but Shinojo, you... No, Lady Hiragi would never hide anything from us, I'm sure of it. But who is this Kamaji you speak of, my lady? I'm not afraid to say that he's the one I love. The one you love? Shinojo, did you honestly think that... What? No, I, uh, <clears throat> I was just clarifying, that's all. I, I would never in my wildest dreams, uh... <clears throat> you two needn't worry. Please, forget that this ever happened. If my father catches word of it, I alone will be held accountable. Yes, of course. As you wish, my lady. But what will happen if your actions here are discovered, Chisato? Don't fret. My father has always been one to spoil me. The worst he'd do is sentence me to half a day without food or something to that effect. Huh. Paimon never suspected a guy like him could have a soft side. I wish you a safe journey. I'm sure we will meet again. Bye, Chisato! Come now. Quit your staring and let's get moving. We've got goods to shift. Uh, all right. Thank you. 